Hi, welcome back this afternoon. I just received the Encouraged Devotional Bible. Uh, this is a gift for my birthday from my husband, so I thought I would share with you um, what's on the inside. It's just going to be a really brief flip through, um, nothing too in depth. So here's a slip cover that comes on the Bible, and I'll just show you the features that are included. And I'll try and show you a bit of these going through here. Okay, so this is the hardcover edition that I have. The spine looks really, really beautiful. And then you can see a little bit of color. And there's also two ribbons, which is awesome, especially for a hardcover. Okay, so let's take a look inside. You have the Bible Belongs To, this is cool, my commitment, today on, whatever date, I, your name, begin a new chapter in my story, I make a commitment to keep diving deeper into God's words so I can know him better and know how my story has always been a part of his story. And then it shows you people in your community, maybe mentors or other women. This is cool too, my commitment to put a date some notes documenting the way God shows up in your life to either give you hope, grace, bravery, beauty, community, leadership, friendship, gratitude, hospitality, and second chances. And you're going to notice that goes along with the themes. Okay, so you have your table of contents. And I'll just show you there's different covers you can get. How to read the Bible. Okay, so here are the features. So you get themes, devotional themes, there's 10. There's reading plans within the themes, reflective devotionals. There's 52 of these. Uh, they anchor uh, for the devotionals for each week of the year, 52 weeks. And then 260 devotionals um, are the personal stories that connect with that with the themes. Then there is Women of Courage. There's 50 of them in the Bible. And you'll notice right here, it's with the theme of Second Chances. There are also book introductions. This is really pretty. You notice on each of the book introductions that the roses are placed in different spots. There's theme verses. So for each theme, there's one in the Old Testament and one in the New Testament. And then you just, it shows that you have journaling space on the bottom, which is Really why I was interested in this Bible was because of the, I'll just show you the journaling space that you see at the bottom. I've always written on the sides, but I'm finding that um, it would be nice to write, especially if you're doing cursive, right across. So as you can see, there's different placement of the roses. See if there's another one you can see. I'm going to go into Genesis so you can see what Genesis looks like. And then the roses are on top. Okay, so what are the devotional themes? So there's beautiful brokenness, better together, daily grace, everyday leadership, Friendship on Purpose, Hope in the Hard, Imperfect Hospitality, Intentional Gratitude, Second Chances, oops, sorry, I'm bumping the tripod, and then you have the Scared, excuse me, the Scared Brave, and it has the devotional reading plans, tells you where to go, as well as it shows you the different colors for each plan, so if you were to just flip, let's just pick a color so green if you're seeing green then you're knowing that that has to do with second chances it also reminds me of washi tape on the side which I like if you see yellow then it will be hope in the hard okay and there's just some information about this 
the Christian Standard Bible, Introduction to the Bible Seraph, it's a font type, tells you about the abbreviations in the CSB Bible. Okay, so with each book of the Bible, it's going to tell you understanding the author's heart, connecting with God's story, connecting with our story, and then you'll find the devotional themes that are in that specific book. So let's go to another book. Again, understanding the author's heart, it's the same here. Connecting with God's story, connecting with our story, and then the devotional themes that will be in there. And there's 10 devotional themes, so in Exodus, you're going to see two, four, six, seven out of the 10. Okay, so this that you see on the side uh, would be one of the women of courage. So you're showing the women of courage in a specific theme as well. So we'll go back over here. So where it says the women of courage, and you see these. Okay, so we'll keep flipping through, looking for different features. Just trying to see if we can find one of the verses for the Old and New Testament. Sorry about that. Okay, so here would be one of the um, the verse themes. Daughter, he said to her, your faith has saved you. Go in peace and be healed from your affliction. And that, let me show the features, is the theme verses. Okay, sorry, this is my first time really going through this. Again, you see the color coding, and this is everyday leadership. So let's just quickly go back to the back. And as well as you can see that it is a sewn binding. Okay, so we'll go back to look at the different things. Okay, so there's 10. This one is beautiful brokenness. Then it tells you the women of beautiful brokenness. And that, I believe, is there five in each? One, two, three, four, five. I believe there's five in each of the themes because there's 10 themes that are together. Daily Grace, Everyday Leadership, Friendship on Purpose, Hope in the Hard, Imperfect Hospitality, Intentional Gratitude, Second Chances, the Scared Brave, Woman of Courage Index. So then if you want to read about a certain woman, just flip through this again so you can see it down here. So there you go. These are the themes. There's 10. Some are five weeks. It seems some can be up to six or seven weeks. Okay, then there's the topic index, and then that's it. And then I'll just show you the ribbons. I did look at this one. This one was really, really beautiful to read. Uh, it also has reflection questions that you can look at. Oops, sorry, I keep bumping this. So yeah, the reflection questions are down here. And then here's another one that I really liked. How did I forget that, sorry, how did I forget that's who he is? And you also notice it'll tell you a scripture to read. So this would be Isaiah chapter 6, verses 1 to 3. And then it has Isaiah 6, and you can read verses 1 to 3. So that's about it for now. Once I start using this, I will give a more in-depth review. I'm excited to dig in and to see what I think about this. And again, I just always ask for grace. This is my first time really making videos, but I'd like to show 
um, the Bibles that I do have and that I get in case they will help you. All right, so this has been the Encourage Devotional Bible from Christian Standard. Um, so I hope you like it. And I'll be doing a more in-depth review once I've had a chance to read through and go through this a little bit more. Okay, have a great day.